Welcome back to another solo unturned video. Today we're going to join a server with over 40 players the whole time and we're going to do some intense PvP against many tryhards, groups and get some really good loot. Now this video is episode 1 of 3 and if you guys do want episode 2 to come out soon make sure to drop a like, let's aim for 400 likes. Make sure to subscribe as well, we're getting very close to 22,000. Last video I announced a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. To claim your prize, please join my discord, link is in the description below and contact me there. This time we're gonna roll another one and it's a lovely bandito mask. To have a chance to win this mythical, all you gotta do is comment something below. Huge shout out to all the members as well as the gifters. If anyone watching right now wishes to become a member, the link is in the description below or click the join button. And let's get straight into the video. Okay, so welcome ladies and gentlemen. I am first time on the server and uh, there are a billion kits which you will unlock with XP and I am going to die. Nice, I have just spawned. Well, this guy's aim is kind of trash. Yeah, he's following me, bro. Uh, I got a shot. I'm gonna kill him with it. No, I'm kidding. I'm gonna turn mythicals off. He's gonna push. I'm gonna do kit start. I don't know what that gives me. Alright, this is a pretty good kid. Okay. I got myself a viper. Alright, well, this guy is not gonna expect what I'm about to do. He's gonna get completely lasered and he's dead. Alright, so something that I've noticed on the server is that it has bullet drop already. And the server is extremely popular. There's like over 40 players. So it's going to be intense, full of PvP. And if these kind of kits are starter kits, then everybody on the server is going to be fully geared. Which makes the server 10 times harder. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna try to take over a base. I don't know if this base over here is actually raided. Yeah, it seems raided. That's actually kind of good. I'm gonna take it over. Alright, yeah, perfect. All I gotta do is a doorway right over here. Alright, tree is chopped. All I need are those tree logs. And I'm gonna make myself some storage as well. There we go, doorway, bam. Fine doorway. And the kit even gave me a door. And a bed. Alright, so in this kind of server, then loot won't really do anything to me. It won't affect me if I lose a ton of good loot. Because it seems like with PvP, we're gonna get everything extremely quickly. But then again, everybody will be with kits. So it's gonna be quite hard to actually survive for a long time. Alright, already I hear a lot of AUG shots. I think that's over a Scorpion 7 or... The town very close to me, so that's exactly right. There's a guy right there. One dead. Another dude. I gotta kill him before he does the kit. He's speaking in game. Come on, bro, peek. He just did the kit, literally. Alright, well, this guy has a Viper kit. I'm pretty sure we're gonna see that a billion times. A Vonya kit, nice. Alright, well, that's a kit I didn't know that existed. Alright, so I'm gonna assume that this video is going to be just full of PvP. Alright, well, there's already an unrated base over here. We might check this out later. Alright, so I am going to head over to Scorpion 7. There is also a small vault system in the server. That's pretty good. There's a guy here. He's dead. Right, I've literally been in the server for 4 minutes. And I already have 75 reputation. Nice. There's also no food or water bars. Literally just a perfect PvP server. Well, there's a guy coming up and I think he actually saw me somehow. There's a lot of people in Scorpion. This guy over here is dead. I had an Eagle Fire. I'm gonna go pick that up really quickly, actually. It's definitely an upgrade from a Viper guy there. I hit him. The guy's geared, actually. Alright, so maybe I can actually try to push in. There's another guy coming. Dude, there's so many people in there. It's actually kind of crazy. There's a guy on the roof. Guy back there as well. Alright, maybe actually I can push down. Kind of scared, to be honest. There's too many. Maybe I can let them kill each other for now. I'm gonna try to shoot this guy. I hit him. And he's obviously gonna go hiding. Alright, well guys, I am in Scorpion 7. I did manage to vault myself an empty heartbreaker and just put a magazine. And there's the guy right in front of me. I see his barrel, so he probably won't expect me. Alright, he's dead. He's... And, and I'm dead. Alright, well, oh, he's a heartbreaker and Vonya. I heard steps, by the way, so I'm going to... I'm gonna put the heartbreaker in my vault for now. I really don't want to lose that gun. Nitrator shots and viper shots. Wait, there's people over here. What? Why hello there? Alright, and I killed them both. He had a Viper kit. I think they're crazy. Here, even more steps. Oh, the server is actually quite chaotic. Literally, every single place that we go, we're gonna find people. I'm getting shot at, I think, with a Heartbreaker. Yeah, I think there are roof campers. We love to see those. There's a loot pile over here. Empty Heartbreaker. Bunch of kits. Nothing that good, though. Right, I'm gonna try to leave Seattle for now. Maybe we'll come back once I have better guns. Because if people have Night Traders and Heartbreakers, I can't really do anything with the Vonya and the Viper, to be honest. Yeah, Saber Tooth as well. Wait, these guys just got out of their base. One guy dead. I need to reload. This guy's missing everything. Kinda once. I'm gonna switch to Vonya. Never mind, I'm dead. There's a guy up there. My right, Heartbreaker. There's another guy somewhere behind me as well. Thankfully, this one has some magazines right over there. He's dead. There's maple strike shots up there. Right, I'm gonna see if that duo that we are PvPing earlier died or something and there's like, their loot, but obviously there isn't. There's an empire though. Some ammo for my heartbreaker, some ammo for the viper as well. Alright, well I'm gonna go back to base and I'm going to store some of these guns. 
Alright, and we are back. Let's go. Now, later on, obviously, I still want to probably do like a one by one full of metal inside this middle of the base. That way, it would technically be mine. Oh, there's a guy right over there. He's dead. Let's go. Any good loot, bro? Vonya kit. Nice. He had the backpack. Oh, there's a guy there as well. My guy was just staring at me. Here, maple strike shots. I actually do want to get the maple strike kit, to be honest. I don't know if it's a kit. Well, there are a lot of chopped trees over here, so it is going to probably be a live bait. Yeah, tree literally just got chopped. I'm gonna go try to kill him. If he's the owner of this base, then he's probably gonna have some good loot. Yeah, he's right over there. He's dead. I heard more steps. Oh, maple strike. My guy has an AUG. Alright, well, he closed the door, obviously. Low caliber box is literally bugging out. I want to get that maple strike and just vault it, man. Drum as well. I will drop that one for now. Alright, drum, let's go. Oh, he's coming out. He's dead. And my guy was on the roof. Alright, so we are coming back. I put the maple strike back in my vault. I actually will not use that gun. I'll just stay there permanently. And he's coming out. Eliminated. And I don't even need to build a plate. I made the plate for absolutely no reason. He has a coalition vest. We love to see that. Fully decked our heartbreaker. Alright, and now we run away. Simple as that. Alright, I'm actually gonna put the fully decked out heartbreaker in my vault. For now, I will use the worser guns until I start getting myself a ton of heartbreakers, maybe. Alright, so bam, back at close at base. There's a guy right here. He's dead. Haha, <laughs> I only had the chainsaw. I'll actually take the chainsaw. There's another guy here. He's dead as well. He had another chainsaw. Nothing that good, though. Oh, there's a guy with a viper over there. Right, he hit me. I need to get close as I'm using a shotgun. Right, where are you, boy? I hear him outside. He's right there. Oh, I might die, actually. Alright, never mind. He's dead. He could have killed me so easily there. He just missed everything. Alright, so I'm probably gonna go to military next. Uh, God knows what kind of PvP is going on over there. Oh, someone's tapping on an eagle fire right next to me. Yeah, he's right here. Hello. Alright, well, a two eagle fires, actually. Definitely an upgrade from a Vonya. Oh, wait, there's a guy right over there. He's just standing still. Right, he's literally one shot away. All right, he's dead. Hopefully, he has some good loot. Right, he died over here, and... All right, yeah, he actually does have some good loot. Heartbreaker, some raw, low torch, some ammo, full military. All right, well, I'm gonna vault the Heartbreaker. I need to empty this vault back in my base, actually. I put the fully decked out weapons, including the maple and Heartbreaker, there. So I always have extra space in my vault. We got ourselves a saber tooth. If I get myself a scope, then I am going to just be sniping with it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back in base. Got myself quite a ton of guns, and we need to make ourselves a bit of more storage, actually, because all of our crates are already full. Got ourselves some raw explosives as well, and a ton of ammo. Now, oh, it's awfully quiet in here, actually. There's some loot on the ground. Oh, there's a guy here, two guys. About that, they actually seem stacked. Alright, yes, nitrate there. At least back. Drum. Dude, they have so much metal. I'll take the raw. I'm gonna pick up all of this metal, actually. We can make so much storage back in base. Another fully decked out heartbreaker. Alright, we're gonna home. I don't think it's actually going to allow us because there's like a combat mode in Russian, I think. I'm gonna take all of this metal. These guys were on a metal run for sure, which is now mine. Haha. <laughs> I'm really happy with the Elise back and the fully decked out guns, though. Mostly. I hear steps. I don't want to die with this, man. I'm gonna hide somewhere. Yeah, there's steps inside, scorpions. And we are back in base. Let's go. All right, so probably with all of this metal, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make myself lockers. All right, there we go. We got our first locker. Easy. Obviously, I'm going to put the high tier loot in there, such as all of the good PvP guns. I mean, that's pretty much all I have till now. And those raw explosives, mostly. Now, on the server, you can get a detonator for 250 XP, which is what I'm currently saving for. We got ourselves another locker, let's go. Alright, I'm next to this duo. One of them's right there. Alright, one's dead. Let's med up. Oh, I see his other guys. Night vision's on. And I'm dead. He's roof camping with an AUG. Well, I'm gonna go through Seattle, which might be completely stupid. There's roof campers over there. I'm gonna jump off the bridge, actually, because it's kind of dumb that I'm up here. There's people on the bridge as well. Hear people talking at the same time. There's people in the post. He's right over there. They're killing each other. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to kill this dude. What? This guy just jumped in front of me. He's dead. I'm getting shot at by two different people. I have no idea how I am alive. <laughs> Alright, let's med up. I killed one that's fully geared actually, so I might try to go for his load. There's a guy inside. Come back here, bro. Right, he's dead. Right, he didn't have anything that good. There's a guy up there. Is he running away? I think he's running away. Uh, maybe I should actually leave Seattle because it's kind of stupid that I'm here. There's too many people. I'm going to go try and check what loot that guy had, actually. The first guy that I killed because he seemed pretty geared. Oh, yeah, this guy is still here. Perfect. They're still building their base. Yes, sir. Fully ducked out heartbreaker. Spec Ops. Get ourselves military night vision, too. All right, and now we leave. There's one of them on the roof, actually. Well, I think he jumped off, actually. I don't know. Well, I'm probably going to vote the good stuff. Oh, there's people here. One guy dead, about dead. 
All right, let's med up. Yeah, they just had more kits. Pretty much every single person that we're killing just has kits. Now, earlier, very, very close to here, we did see a live base, which is this one right over here, actually. So you gotta be careful that people don't come running out. All right, that's exactly what happened. All right, he's dead. Yeah, there's people inside. I right hear steps on the bed. So that means it's a duel because he couldn't have home this quickly. Since there's a 10 second call. Yeah, he's right here. He's dead. Orc shots. Let's med up. We're almost dead. Guy over there. Dead. He's coming out. Other guy is somewhere back there. They both literally just ran out. Where did he go? Is he circling around? Yeah, he is. Trying to be sneaky. Alright, so I did leave that PvP that was happening very close to Seattle. There are people building to a blimp. There's a guy up there. He has a shadow stalker. Wait, he fell off. Alright, he's dead. Another guy fell off. And I have no ammo. Right, let's switch to Schofield. Where the hell did he even go? Shadow Stalker, he has a calling card as well. Wait, where is he? Wait, did he die from full damage or something? He literally vanished. I don't see him anywhere. There's a naked here. Yeah, he had nothing. I'm so confused. I don't know where that guy went. Right, anyway, we got ourselves an easy calling card and he's a Shadow Stalker. Nice. Oh, I'm getting shot. Alright, last bullet killed him. He seemed like he only had an Empire kid though. There's a guy there. He's dead. There's a guy there. Alright, he's dead. My guy's a green skin. He had a uh, least back calling card. That's another kid, probably. And two wardrobes. There's another guy there. He's dead. I'm gonna take the wardrobes. Take the low caliber. I'm gonna go check out what this dude over here had. And then we'll home because I am actually full of loot. Oh, yeah, I think he's actually a naked. Oh, no, there's a loot pile at the bottom. He had a Vonya kit. Nice. Well, alright everybody, that's going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you guys want episode 2 to come out where this time we'll go on the same server, but I will actually be in a group and we're going to do some probably even more intense PvP and even a raid. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.